From early detection to education, Waterman's investment in technology and innovation provide its breast cancer patients with an exceptional continuum of care. Florida Hospital Waterman doctors Robert Perdon and Jeffrey Brabham, radiation oncologists at Florida Hospital Waterman's Cancer Institute, recently hosted seminars on the advancements in and the importance of radiation treatment for breast cancer patients. In general with breast cancer, the treatments have really evolved over the years towards less invasive treatment and more convenient treatment while not sacrificing anything in terms of efficacy. Uh, in terms of radiation, that means uh, quicker courses of radiation, either with more condensed external beam fractionations or with accelerated partial breast irradiation, which can condense a course of radiation which typically lasts about seven weeks into just five treatment days. Brachytherapy is a form of radiation therapy where you can deliver a high dose of radiation therapy in a short period of time to a limited volume. The advantage of it, it's far more convenient and can be much better targeted. It's probably the most conformal way to deliver radiation therapy. When we give brachytherapy for breast cancer, it's based on specific sets of criteria. Uh, usually it's small breast cancers, it's infiltrating, usually in women who are postmenopausal, and locations where you can put the catheter or the device and still achieve a good cosmetic result. Cancer can spread really three different ways throughout your body. It can spread locally, meaning it just grows out further and further um, into whatever's surrounding it. It can spread into the lymph nodes, which means through the lymphatic channels um, and settle into the, the way stations where all of our fluid in our body is um, digested and infections attacked, and that's the lymph nodes or can spread distantly uh, throughout the blood, really to any place in the body. Uh, for cancers that spread um, locally and regionally, uh, regionally um, means lymph nodes. The lymph nodes are very important. And in many cancers, it's been determined um, the number of lymph nodes you have involved correspond very strongly to your likelihood of being cured. Um, and so we look at that very closely with any type of surgery. With radiation therapy, we often treat lymph nodes that uh, we know have a high likelihood of being involved in an attempt to catch the cancer there before it spreads any further. So we, we do pay a lot of attention to lymph nodes. We also had a chance to speak with one of Waterman's breast cancer patients who says that one missed mammogram was all it took. I was first diagnosed through regular screening. I had missed the year before and my doctor was like, you didn't go, you need to follow up. And so just to appease him, I said okay and um, when he called me in for my results and then he told me I was diagnosed with breast cancer, I was shocked because I just was certain he was wrong. My recommendation for other women is do not miss your mammogram, just don't miss your mammogram. I cannot stress that enough. I didn't find anything, I was healthy, I had no issues whatsoever. I only went to the doctor because it was the annual thing you're supposed to do. I can't stress strongly enough how important it is to get your mammogram. Um, I had missed mine for one year. I was fortunate that they found it, it was very small. Um, I'm grateful that I went the year I did and didn't let it go a whole year. You'll find contact information to all the services offered at Florida Hospital Waterman's Cancer Institute when you click the Treatment Advances story link icon on our homepage, yourhometownhealth.com.